everyone, my name is Elliot and welcome back to another spiral stage lighting video. Now, you sometimes get in dip switches in lighting and sometimes it's extremely hard, sometimes it's ex really easy. Depends on your math skills. But also, um, you can do it, I'm going to be showing you how to do it really quickly in this video. Now, before we get started, you can follow us, uh, um, follow us on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram, which is just simply Spiral Stage Lighting. The links, w the links of the uh, of Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter will be in the description. And if you'd like, you can donate to my service, where I can get better equipment and improve it. So yeah, let's get into it. So, uh, dip switches. What are dip switches? So, dip switches is where you put your, um, which is uh, your DMX address. And also you can make the light what you want to do. So let's say auto or something like that. Um, it's usually in back of lights, but also on like moving heads or LED pars. Sometimes you can get the um, like the DMX panel so it has a screen or it looks like a little calculator. Um, that doesn't include maths, but dip switches it does. Um, so I'm going to be showing you how to do that today. So binary what's binary binary is um where com computers communicate to each other so it's a series of numbers which is one and zero um also um it, it's included in dip switches and um, i'm going to showing you um i'm going to be showing you how to do it really quickly so here we are on shovitdj.com um Shavit dj has um a special um page where which is a, di um, a dip switch calculator so it's instant now you don't obviously need a computer for this you can use if you want to you can do it out the hard way where you actually calculate it or yourself you can download an app if you want and um also you can just go on your phone and just down download an app or just go onto a website which is Shovit DJ and stuff like that. So yeah. So let's put the number nine nine nine. If we put nine 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 it will say this site says input out of range or just to say input out of range. So which is a good thing so it tells you oh you're out of range. So yeah. Um let's put the number eighty seven now the numbers will go down um, one two three five and seven but the number um, th these numbers actually have numbers below them as well i'm not sure what numbers they are um, um i'm not really yeah i'm not really sure what numbers they are but uh, yeah it says on which means the ones that are down is on i think and then the ones up uh, um off um you can search it up on google um on like uh, more information on dip switches and get um, more ideas into your head and stuff so here is the binary down here so this is currently showing um zero one zero one zero one 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 one, one, yeah, and um, that is the binary of this right now. So let's put another uh, num another number in. One. Now you can see one is on. If we put two in, two, three. Now you can see how it was like one. So let me show you that again. So you see how it's one. Put two in. Two. But when we put three in, it changes. You see how the rest, it, only one and two is down and the rest is up. Basically, um, this means this, um, it's three. So don't think it's like if you, um, which, like, don't think if I just put nine, um, that goes down and stuff like that. So um, you can search more on Google and stuff. I mean, obviously it is pretty hard, but if you learn, you can, um, include your math skills into it you can go on YouTube and find out more information um, on the numbers and actually how to actually calculate it and yeah um, I hope this video um, helped you you can like and subscribe if you want and um, I hope you enjoyed um, I'll see you later